Now to introduce you to your first grace note. Um, if, if you want to play a series of A's, one after the other, you can't do that on the bagpipe because you can't stop the sound. So we have to use a grace note to mark the beginning of each note. And the, the one we use mo mainly is a G grace note, which is this G finger at the top here is just going to bounce very, very slowly. Okay, just literally like that. As small and as economic a movement as you can make. And just practice that a few times uh, rhythmically. becomes more important to be accurate is when you're moving from one note to another like uh, like that as you're playing the G grace note between a, um, one note and the other and the G grace note is actually think of it as the cement between the notes so when you want to move say from A to B using a grace note then you lift the grace note first and then as the grace note goes down again, you do the change to B. So we start on low A, we lift the grace note, and then as you put the grace note down again, you move to the note you want to be on, which is B. Played very slowly, it sounds like... Like that. Very important to do that so that the, the, the G grace note always starts first and you don't like that move to the note you want and then play the grace note. You've played it too late. Or if you play it, you've played it too early because you played it on the low A and then did the move. The important thing is that the G grace note is being played. You make the change from one note to another while the G grace note is up in the air. And then as this gets faster and smaller, you can be more and more accurate. Try going down as well. Alright, and that's the same. Whichever note you're starting from and whichever note you're going to finish on, if you're playing a G grace note on it, lift the G grace note first and then move to the note you want to be on. So if you want to play from A to uh, E, for instance, you want to start on and you want to finish on then we're going to lift the G grace note first and then as it comes down we'll change to the E we, we want to be on. So it would sound And when you get it up to speed, it'll sound like... 